homeowner complains of water dripping obviously it's pushing this paint off all the way over to here when we get up there what we find is a gutter now even though it's leaking way over here and, uh, there's really nothing over here I think a lot of it is just wicking from this gutter wicking back over from all of this 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 is definitely an, a hole going in clearly it's leaking in here as well we may have some leaking over here as well so this is copper and they have it bent up here but on the end they didn't leave it long to go up so it looks like they got some ice and water coming down and then they just caulked it so i'm dollars to donuts that's a leak right there too i'm certain of it so we got to get the leaf blower up here clean this out and we'll see if we can't get this fixed okay smart high quality home maintenance we just got done cleaning up this gutter they had a caulk joint here which is joining nothing there's there's not a joint there so i just took all that caulk out there is not a anyway no lap they had ice and water coming down from the roof and then underneath and they still do it's trapped under there we're not going to get it out we're not going to dick with that the reason it's there is for uh, probably electrolysis with dissimilar metals um, and you can see that they have this pop riveted down which you know whatever it's maybe in some cases it does need to be done so we've got some 4500 and we're gonna caulk from there down and then caulk this joint here and then we're gonna really weave a, a caulk joint here you know what I could I could just take my putty knife and torch and I could just cut that with my heated up putty knife I think that's what I'm gonna do all right that worked out pretty good so I heated it up heated up the putty knife got it underneath there and I came back and it was still warm and I kind of sliced it a little bit not putting too much pressure on it because I don't want to cut into the aluminum that's down here so I got that out so now we'll put a, a nice simple bead there up around into this corner and in there and we'll call this good okay so Mitchell just got done cocking this looks pretty good got it all I'm satisfied with it and then I'm just gonna put this as a this is a heat tape so they kind of want that back in and kind of got to do this here hopefully help help Kind of messing that up a little bit, but what can a guy do? Okay, I think we got her good to go. All right, that's it. Mark, high quality home maintenance. Mark and Mitchell.